And we start tonight with coroners across the Midlands seeing spikes in the number of COVID related deaths. As Eleanor Tabone explains, some coroners are running out of room to store the bodies. It's kind of like a redo of last year. In Sumter County, storage space is running thin. We've had to borrow an extra uh, cooler from a mobile cooler from our hospital. Sumter County Coroner Robbie Baker says he's seeing at least three COVID related deaths a day. We're actually dealing with a lot of them on home deaths that we're actually testing and the majority of them have been positive. Majority of the dead, he says, unvaccinated. 95% of all the COVID deaths that we've had in the last two months have unfortunately been from people that were not vaccinated. I would say probably for Newberry, it's been two or three cases per week that have been COVID related. Newberry County Coroner Laura Neese says she too is seeing an uptick. For several months that we weren't getting any COVID related deaths. Her biggest fear, keeping up. We definitely are going to need manpower resources. According to DHEC, there were 158 deaths from Thursday to Saturday. The hospital morgue facilities are not large enough to handle the number of deaths that they're having, um, so they're needing additional space. Sabrina Gast, president of the South Carolina Coroners Association, says coroners across the state are requesting resources. Morgue trailer support, so refrigerated storage to hold the seeds. A message from those who see tragedy daily. Please go out there and, and get vaccinated. If not for your own self, but if you've got children and grandchildren. In Columbia, Eleanor Tabone, News 19 WLTX.